Right, so question six, we got a, a grid here with uh, two shapes, P and Q, and we're asked to describe fully the single transformation that maps shape P onto shape Q. And um, when you see these transformation questions and you're asked to describe, always a good um, technique is to look at the number of marks for the question, because generally that's the amount of, uh, it's the number of pieces of information you are going to be required to give. So three marks means I'm going to need three pieces of information. So let's have a look. Um, well, P to Q, I can clearly see that it's P has gotten bigger. It has enlarged. So I can clearly say it's an enlargement. Enlargement. Um, can I work out the scale factor? Well, let me see. The base is 2 here, and the base is now 2, 4, 5. So that it's gone from 2 to 5. So that seems like two and a half times. Let's check the height. The height was two. That is also two, four, it's five. So that's two and a half. So yeah, it's a scale factor of 2.5. Enlargement with scale factor 2.5 or two and a half if you like. That's two pieces of information. And the third piece of information is the center of the enlargement. And the way to find that is to take out your ruler and draw a line from corresponding vertices. So I'm going to draw a straight line from that vertex through that vertex. And just, I can, it can be as long as I like. So I'll go back and that seems to pass through the point zero, zero. And let's check and see what happens when I go from that vertex through the corresponding vertex and go back. Oh, that also goes through zero, zero. And I'm fully expecting this to pass through zero, zero. And we can see that it does. So zero, zero is the center of the enlargement. So it's an enlargement with a scale factor of 2.5 through through zero, zero. And that's your three marks.